Well, welcome back, everyone. So happening this weekend, a chance for you and your pets to celebrate the holidays. You can check out the Critter Holiday Bazaar that's happening tomorrow in Greenville. Let's get straight to 7 News. is Christine Scarfelli. She's live at Phyllis Wheatley Community oh, Center with all the pre-fun. And, um, you know, it's never too early for a pet party, as you call it, Christine. <laughs> No, we're having a pet party. That's right, Greenville. I'm telling you, the whole city's going to show up. I don't blame them. Phyllis Wheatley Center. I don't even think it's open yet, guys. But of course, we busted up in here with all the all the animals. They will be here tomorrow too. Listen, remember 10 to 3, the Critters Holiday Bazaar, a chance to I think celebrate, ladies, our pets, yes. our humans, our animals. Oh my gosh, look at Toby milking it here this morning. <laughs> we are so excited. So we've got rescues here this morning, nonprofits. This is an educational event tomorrow as well as a great place to get Christmas presents even Santa photos ladies yes. what am I missing um, tickets how to get here and what you can expect um, we're gonna have some fantastic raffle prizes including a full week of doggy daycare from Dogtopia wow. That's super exciting snoozer pet beds has wonderful uh, donated some wonderful beds and they're made right here in Piedmont local businesses, local businesses. businesses. way to support them thank yes. you great and then we're gonna have a fantastic costume contest for your pet no now Christy yes. Tor, do you guys Sorry. have pets that are gonna be here as well We'll see if Cosmo will, will do it. I don't know. He has a Santa suit, so we'll see. Cosmo, your cat, yes, very Cosmo good. Yes, Cosmo, your cat. Okay. I don't think my two dogs will be here, but no. no. Understood. Yes. No problem. You <laughs> encourage viewers, though, to bring their yes, animals. Please, Everyone please. should bring their dogs and so, um, make sure good. they wear super cute costumes very and good. they can win some great prizes. Very good. You've, you've kind of gone through the full gamut here. We've got Santa, which I know these photos are really hard to come by in some cases. Yes. For a decent price. Absolutely. And this is a great chance. You can bring your children, too, and they can and pop in the photo with the family dog, uh, bring grandma, bring grandpa, whatever, and get a family pet photo. And I know, anchors, I know you guys want another pet. You need another family member <laughs> over there. Foster Paws is ready to adopt out one of those cats. I've already put your name in, so you can you can take them home. A foster, again, you're caring for them for a few weeks, we hope, because I know you're just going to adopt immediately. Um, and if not, Santa Matt is going to gift you the animal for Christmas. <laughs> I've set all of this up guys a lot of fun remember yeah. 10 to 3 tomorrow right here phyllis wheatley center right near nickel town community and of course they're so pet friendly absolutely what fun yes i love it guys you ready to come down field trip i'm ready i was just really you know distracted yeah. by that love connection i don't know if you got to see it <laughs> between that ferret and that dog <laughs> right there <laughs> it is so cute it was there, a love there connection. is a love connection for there sure there definitely oh, yeah. is i love the love, oh, love the in ferret. the house i know Every, everybody's look getting along there <laughs> look how oh, yeah. adorable they're stealing the show guys oh, oh that's stealing okay the show. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, let's get to Fred. Bye, Look. Christine. That is adorable. Aww. Well, next on Carolina Morning, we got a warning from police in the upstate about a new way scammers are stealing thousands of dollars from seniors. Plus, we'll have a check of your weather. Top